can continue to track some development in Northwest Ohio tonight. You may remember the old Woodville Mall. Yeah, you can see some of the after effects behind us. It's been a decade since it shut down for good, but there is some new life coming to the old commercial space. Chase Bachman talked with the team behind the project. And all of it is uh, is a work in progress. It's taking longer than we had hoped, but we're moving forward. So the last 15 months haven't been without challenges from the pandemic to supply chain issues and labor shortages. Developer Glenn Grisdale says it's been rough. We started executing a plan. Of course, it was in the middle of COVID and with the supply chain issues and the labor issues, we were still able to forge ahead with certain aspects of the site. But there is light at the end of the tunnel. Grisdale says he hopes to see the community center and some of the townhomes standing in the next two years. Development uh, off to the distance here will be built probably uh, in their fourth phase by the end of 2024. And then everything will probably just uh, melt into it based upon all the investment that the public is putting into the private uh, property. That private property is right next to the Biltmore Gardens neighborhood. Chuck Wood has lived in the area for more than 50 years and remembers the old Woodville Mall and Great Eastern Shopping Plaza in its heyday and its decline. It deteriorates so far and, uh, you know, and that was a great place when it started, when I was just a kid then. Wood says he's glad to see something happening at the property and hopes it brings more people to this quiet side of town. It's about time for something. We need something on the east side. You know, we have no uh, uh, stores or anything here. I hope they're going to bring some good stores in. That's going to help uh, not be competitive with the malls on the other side of town and stuff like that. Reporting in Northwood, Chase Bachman, WTOL 11. And developers say the first thing that we can expect to see is the new community center and splash pad. Then crews will wrap up work on the townhomes.